this is my second drink of the night. This is what I'm having right now. I'm having a little mini. It's called Sheepdog, which is a peanut butter whiskey, and it is 70 proof, but they're trying to be cute on the label, and they say 70 wolf. I don't know if you can see that. And it's brought to you by the Sazerac Company, which makes almost everything under the sun whiskey. Uh, there's nothing more or less to this except that it's a peanut butter whiskey and it has a little dog paw on it. So let's crack this one open. I'm expecting this to taste quite frankly or horribly. And, um, you know, peanut butter is something I like with peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. However, peanut butter whiskey is a different thing. I just don't think it would taste good. And Sazerac is making this little cheap thing. Um, probably out of some of the whiskey that they produced that didn't come out right. So they'll just like add a little bit of peanut butter flavoring and boom, you have yourself a mini that you can buy for probably $1.29 at your local like uh, package store. I think I got this at a Total Wine. So uh, let's pour it in. This is what it looks like. Doesn't have a very good whiskey appearance. It's not much color to it. It's not uh, like brown enough to be looking like a quality whiskey and um, it looks kind of watery also how's it smell that's interesting they they make it smell like peanut butter they really do it smells like peanut butter and rubbing alcohol but it's something about the peanut butter it doesn't taste like it doesn't smell like the peanut butter butter that you would get if you just Took your knife into a Jiffy um, uh, bottle or jar and smelled it. It just, it's something a little bit off putting with this, um, with this uh, peanut butter flavor. So let's give it a taste. What the heck? It's only $1.29. Prost, my friends. Oh, it's definitely sweet. Definitely sweet. Has a very boozy taste to it. Which is interesting since it's only 35% alcohol by volume, 70 proof. Tastes very boozy. And has this sweet, like, peanut butter taste. Let's see what the label says, folks. Um, let me just break down and get out my spectacles. You know, folks, I always talk about my glasses and I really try not to use them because they make me look old. But uh, let's see. Whiskey with natural flavors and caramel color. So that's that's a dead giveaway. As caramel color, meaning if it did not have the color, it wouldn't look as brown and it doesn't even look that brown to begin with. So, it can't have but just a little bit of peanut butter in it. Because as you know, peanut butter is like a medium brown color. And if you have to put caramel color in to make it look like this, it can't possibly have a lot of true, legitimate peanut butter flavor. So, um, it is flavored with natural flavors that peanut butter they use is probably ever so slight and then they use some other thing on God's green earth which kind of smells like peanut butter and if you put the two together then you get a peanut butter essence at least uh, so how would I rank this well it's a mini it's a dollar twenty five I'm not going to poo poo it I'm not going to fail it you know this is one of those things, and I say this all the time, it is what it is. It's a mini, it's flavored whiskey. You shouldn't expect much. If you do get something that tastes good, it's like playing with house money. Otherwise, this is as expected. So this is a meeting expectations. So I'm not gonna give it a grade. I'm gonna say it met my expectations. It did not disappoint me. 
It did not surprise me. It is what I thought it was going to be. It meets my expectations. It tastes like bad whiskey flavored with a little bit of peanut butter and something only God knows. So, try it yourself. Sheepdog. Sheepdog peanut butter whiskey. Try it yourself. Tell me what you think. Am I being a little bit too harsh? I don't think I'm really being harsh because I said it met expectations. Or am I missing something? You know, is this truly what a peanut butter whiskey should taste like? Even though I don't know if there's a lot of peanut butter whiskeys out there on the market. Just let me know. If you're here for the first time, welcome. I have a whole lot of videos. I have other videos with minis. I have videos with regular whiskey, I have beer videos, I have wine videos, I have cocktail videos. If you're, if you're back again, thank you for your support. It means so much to me. Stay safe and stay sane and I will see you on the next video.